Hey family, it's the Mobile Home Diva and in today's video, I just wanted to answer a question that I got from Virtuous to Mommy Family. She's actually a YouTuber. She has her own channel here on YouTube and she wrote me, well, she actually sent me a video message um, on my Instagram, which I am so sorry, Virtuous to Mommy. I am not good at um, responding to social media or posting to social media or any of that. I promise to get better soon. But Virtuous to Mommy family had an awesome question about mobile home depreciation. I'm not a professional by any means, but this was a question that I had. And this was a question that I asked the manager um, of Clayton Homes when I purchased my home, as well as other managers at other facilities and people who were familiar with the process. So I wanted to answer your question with the response that I have gotten from so many people. Now, people that I have listened to on YouTube um, who have somewhat recorded their journey or had experiences have said that manufactured homes depreciate. Just like purchasing a car, when you take it off the lot, it loses all its value, yada, yada, yada. The professionals have given me an, another insight. And so I wanted to share that insight with you because a manufactured home can lose this bag. If you take a manufactured home and sit it on a mobile home lot where there are other mobile homes parked there um, and you're renting the space, then it loses its value. And that is with anything that you purchase. Um, not anything that you purchase, but it, with a manufactured home. What helps the value and what causes you to not, for it to not depreciate is attaching it to land. You said that you're purchasing um, your own land. So if your home, of course, the wheels are taken off and it's put on a solid foundation on your land, then you are adding value to the property, to your property. If you take a look at some of the videos um, of my husband and I's property, our home sits on a concrete foundation we did a land home package and we're doing other things to add value to the property. My husband's building a tool shed. Um, we um, have steps and decks. We've added gutters to the home. Um, just general upkeep of our yard. And we're constantly upgrading around our house. Not for any other reason, but our own comfortableness. However, all of those things add value to your property. So yes, your manufactured home can lose its value if it's not attached to property. Do a land home package, purchase some land and put your manufactured home on it, put it on a solid foundation. Used to have a choice about wheels. Now you really don't. So I don't think it's necessary to say but i'll say it anyway take it off the wheels they're not going to leave it on wheels it class a manufactured homes are not left on the wheels they're detached the wheels are taken off and they're attached to a solid foundation all of those things add value to the cost of your home now with anything that you purchase that can be moved it, it does lose a measure of its value but you have the ability is what i'm saying to put the value back and to add to the value. So don't let that deter you. 
you can purchase a manufactured home the way you want. We actually have the unfinished, you can see the, I don't know if you can really see it on this video, but see behind the picture, you see the seam. We have the seams in our walls. We didn't get the finished drywall. We only paid 69000 for this home, but we put a lot into the overall property to make this home um, what we want it to be. But you can get the finished drywall. We have vents in the floor. You can get them in the ceiling. You can do all the upgrades. We have the black appliances if you want the stainless steel, um, if you want um, upgraded cabinets, if you want brick versus concrete. We actually got the concrete blocks. Maybe you want bricks. Maybe you want to sit it on a basement. It's really up to you. Whatever you need to do to make the home comfortable for you. But unless you're planning to be flipping, if this is the home that you, if, if you find the home that you want and this is a home that you're going to be in for a while, eventually you may want to sell it. Continue to make upgrades to it. Continue the upkeep of the home so that you will be able to sell it. Someone would be happy to purchase that home sitting on its own land. Okay. Okay, put it on a in a mobile home park. No, it's not gonna. It's gonna lose value, hands down. Attach it to property, and you got yourself a good deal. I hope I've answered that question. Um, I wish that um, we could have talked so I could answer any other questions that you have. Um, and I'm extending this to anyone who has questions for me i can only share my experience or from my research and i'm more than happy to do additional research when necessary but it is 11 o'clock at night and i just wanted to answer virtuous to mommy family um this question because i get this question so much but i can always be emailed at the email below uh the mobile home diva at gmail.com okay so, oh, and if for anybody else, I well, I'll put that in another video. This isn't the video, but I just wanted to share that. I wanted to give you my response, my research, and I wanted to say um, if this is a home that you plan on putting love into, on being in for a while, enjoying it with your family, then by all means, go for it. Like, um, it's just like buying a car. Yeah, when you take a car off the lot, it does lose its value, but it doesn't make you not want to drive it. You're going to have that car for a while. You're going to take care of that car. And eventually, one day, you may be able to sell it. No, you, you may not get what you purchased it for, but that's because this is something moving. It's not attached to anything. Um, there's no way to keep the value of it. But a home, you can definitely um, keep the value and add value to it by what you do with it and what you put into it. So take those steps to ensure that you're adding value to your home, attaching it to land and um, adding the things to it that are going to help it to increase or the things to your property that's going to help increase um, the value. Another thing that we did, we planted trees around the property. We have... Um, uh, crepe myrtles around the property um, and different things that make the property look attractive. Now, of course, th those crepe myrtles aren't adding value to the home per se, but they're adding value to the lot. They're giving the lot eye appeal. Um, and a lot of times the landscaping and the overall look of the property is one thing that sells a person that's looking to purchase So. I hope that that answer was helpful. If you have any other questions, email me again at the mobile home diva at gmail.com. Thank you so much for your question. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.